Hey everyone, thank you so much for tuning into my channel. Welcome back. So in today's video, I will, as promised, I will walk you through on how to build a do-it-yourself website. So first thing that we need to do is we need to sign up for a web hosting services. Okay, that's first thing. And second is we need to set up your content management system, which is for free. So in this example, we will use WordPress. And then lastly, you will have the chance to design your own website up to you. So you can check mine. Um, you can visit www.libanmilangastravel.com Okay, so here we go. This is my DIY website. So I built it, I built it myself. And um, yeah, it's basically some blog posts on my travel, my personal trips. And also some promotions. I put here some itineraries. And um, yeah, so I would like to take this opportunity. If some of you would like to create your own DIY website, if you would like to create your website, please go to my website first and then click on this link. This is my affiliate links with with green kicks yeah i'm one of their affiliates and then if you would like to create your website and you click from here i will get a portion on yeah on every successful um sign up of a website through green kicks um, i have put here integrate two links so you can either click this or the other one i have this one so it works the same okay please <laughs> just in case if you would like to um you know support my channel i would really appreciate that so yeah you might want to ask why green gigs so to tell you honestly before green gigs i'm with ipage so um ipage has the the cheapest as well so i've been with ipage for like a year and then um yeah i just research and then check if which you know a web hosting services is the best one and i found green gigs aside from uh, offering you the best performance it's also number one green energy web hosting provider so that's perfect aside from a very uh very good performance you're also helping the mother earth so how awesome right anyway so um since we're trying to build a website and would like to use um, wordpress as our content management system then uh, we can just select on the plans available right here so um if as you can see um the, the cheapest and then this also applies to the type of website that we're trying to build so since we're just trying to build a small website for yeah this website that I'm about that I'm about to create is for my brother he's planning to sell goods online so um, yeah so we're just gonna uh, use this first as a starter kit okay so just need to click this plan and then under wordpress hosting there is also a lot of plans on it so you can also select so i would still prefer this two and 95 cents two dollars and 95 cents per month okay get started and from here it says congratulations your plan qualifies for a free domain registration which means your domain registration such as your personalized web address for example um, my brother's uh, website domain that he preferred is this no. this okay so you can click on check availability all right so perfect so when I check on um, availability it's available so which means I can go ahead and use this this web address or this domain so from there you can now start um, entering your information so here you need to put in email address personal information 
So basically, you can just put your email address. All right, and then country, postal code, phone number. And this is your option, whether or not you would like um, a year or monthly. You know, as you can see, the, um, the longer, the better. Okay, so mine, I, I've chosen the longer one the three years contract because it's much cheaper plus if you think that your website would be good as long term then I think this one is the best pick right so okay server location you can I think you can choose so either way I think Europe is well <laughs> this is really up to you okay um, what's this in your screen can we do that validate so do we have I, I don't think that it does have okay okay what if I hmm. I like that because they're not gonna show your information like your information from here it will not be viewable or it's invisible to other person like if they would like to stalk you and would check your personal information if you would don't like to uh, get this offering you would only gonna be charged this amount but if you're gonna choose but I would highly recommend if you would involve or if you would include it it's really helpful for a security reason Okay, then your credit card information and that's it. You're good. You just need to click on create and get started. Okay, so since this is personal information that I'm about to enter, so I'll just gonna go ahead and post the video and we'll uh, resume um, once I'm done and then we'll start um setting up the content management system which is the wordpress okay once done signing up the account i will get that all right thank you all right so i just sent and uh, click on the create an account and then get started you'll be routed to this page so thank you your order is complete so i waited for like an hour um before all else has been submitted or sent to my to the email that i registered so um i think that's just normal because they're trying to you know to um to configure from their end like everything for your account but if you think it, it took a little bit longer mine i've waited for an hour so i sent up like around 10 30 and because I'm uh, I, I've been waiting for like 30 minutes already I tried reaching out their chat support so you can click here or you can click this one this this image or this how do you call that icon and click like that just click on it and then uh, you can have someone to assist you okay so so here are the information that was sent to us so um here we go so as you can see i requested like around 10 38 and it looks like that it, it there was a delay for an hour so i contacted them via the chat support and then around this time so an hour okay so if you would experience the same you don't need to worry okay you don't need to worry uh, they're just um, having um, they need time for them to set up your account okay so uh, just what I've said the next step that we need to do is to set up the uh, um, the content management system which is true um, WordPress and for you to do that you need to log in to your c panel your control panel where you can set up the email your personalized email like my email uh, live with my longest travel like this email i have this one at the top this email you can set that up it's for free 
okay once you have your your web hosting um, you can set this up so you can have as many emails as you want you can have inquiry at, at domain.com admin at domain.com hello at domain.com so it really up to you okay so um, from here these are the important information that you need to keep because all of the account details are all listed right here like your contract your invoice everything you need to keep it and save everything you, if you, there's a need for you to print then go ahead and print it okay so I'll just log into our account Alright, so I've already logged into the newly created web hosting domain and uh, this is how it looks like on your dashboard, okay? So let's click on the dashboard and yeah, you'll see here um, what is the inclusion of the web hosting that was just purchased. So there's uh, hosting information, domain, security support. So basically, what is the information of the plan that you've um, selected? So it shows here the the um, web address or your um, URL. So this is the one that I've created. And so for you to set up the the other configuration or the setting such as integration of the cms or the content management system where in this example we will use wordpress.com wordpress content management system we need to um, click on the c panel right here so let's click it all right so this is the control panel or the c panel after logging into the account so you just need to scroll down at the bottom of this dashboard and you'll be able to because our goal for this video is to set up the wordpress integration so for you to be able to um, yeah if you're planning to have a website that posts blogs specifically for travel or, or anything or any kind of niche that you're planning to have then um, I, WordPress is highly recommended so you just need to click on this okay all right so as you can see we're now on the WordPress and we're about to install so um, these were all just basic information that is actually available right here so after the installation your WordPress account will be um, will be available on this on this URL or this website since this is basically your domain okay your domain name so um, uh, this can be edited all right you can edit this what kind of word that you would want to put so say you have some, um, something like that and then um, next is the um, admin account um, for a security reason because this is the real account now um, you will have here your admin username and then you can also provide your password okay and you also have the option to choose languages right here and there's also some setting predefined setting and then there are predefined um, themes that you can choose from it's free okay uh, if you don't select any theme then WordPress will be the one to select on your behalf but you can um, set it up or you can change it anytime okay so once selected for example you have selected this and click on install 
it would install WordPress content management system on your domain. All right, so it's simple. So say for example, since I've already um, set it up, okay, I've already set that up. So let's see, let's try right here. I've already set that up. Alright, so after clicking the URL or your website domain, so here we go. This is what we created earlier from our control panel um, using when we try to integrate WordPress content management system. So WordPress is just a free content management system um, partnered with Green Geeks, okay? You're only gonna pay the domain web hosting domain via green gigs and then they have a partnership with wordpress and you can integrate that if you could see earlier there's a lot of option but i highly recommend um, wordpress if you're into blogging if you would like to post some blogs or reviews on the products that you're selling online so um wordpress is the best pick okay so stay tuned uh, there will be another video on how to set up your personalized email i'll create another video for that okay and for now um we have covered we sign up for a web hosting through green Geeks, and then we integrated wordpress as our content management system so this is the very simple okay um simple working when we tried to test it it's already working so we just need to uh, configure how to put on the tabs at the top like right here we can put home about us all of the uh, tabs that you would want to be available right here you, you would want to set up right here so those are menus that you would like to um, put on your website that will make it easier for your user or your visitor to navigate on your site so we'll be posting another video for that um, our next video will be on how to set up the email the personalized email for example inquiry at salabogdugotrading.com something like that or admin at domain.com so that's very personalized. It's unique for you and it's unique for your website. And that's it for now. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye!